Hello there. So we've just popped in to feed the miniature Shetlands here at the Dorset Heavy Horse Farm Park. And this is Alice tucking into her food. Now these horses are small, but they are very, very strong. Shetland ponies are the st actually stronger than heavy horses and all other pony and horse breeds. Shetlands can pull twice their own weight and can carry up to 130 pounds. Now, Alice doesn't pull up to 130 pounds, but she does pull the children around the farm park when we are open. And she loves to work. Each morning she'll run outside ready to get harnessed up. And she really does enjoy meeting all the visitors on the farm. Now she's looking a bit scruffy at the moment because all our horses and ponies are losing their winter coats ready to come into the summer season. Isn't that right, Alice? So Shetland ponies, they originated in Shetland Isles. Small horses have been kept in the Shetland Isles since the Bronze Age, so a really long time. Now due to the climate, long cold winters meant limited food supply for large horses with, la with large appetites. And we've got plenty of those here at the Heavy Horse Farm. As the horses adapted to the harder lifestyle, they grew smaller in size and so the Shetland Pony developed. Miniature Shetland ponies came about from breeding only the smaller horses. Now, Shetland ponies were first used for pulling carts, hauling peat and ploughing farmland. But as the Industrial Revolution increased, the need for coal in the mid-19th century meant thousands of Shetlands travelled to the mainland of Britain to become pit ponies. Here at the farm park we do have a pit pony exhibit and when we're open, the children can come round and feed the miniature Shetlands and learn all about the pit ponies. So hopefully we'll pop into you a bit later in the week and give you a little bit of history on the horses that used to work down in the mines. Until then, it's goodbye from me and it's goodbye from Alice. Take care.